What's good, my damies? is Jaws. I'm over here taking my son to a daggone job interview. He's over there getting an interview right now. I ain't going to tell you where he's working at because I don't like putting my kids out there. But whatever, it is what it is. But he's over there getting a job interview, which is real cool. But anyway, I wanted to, I had a topic I wanted to talk to you all about a couple times. But, um, and this is important, man. It was like, I wanted to talk about, like, you know, low self-esteem and where that comes from and, like, how that happens. And really, it's just about the things that we believe about what people say about us. You know, as a kid, man, I remember in the fifth grade, you know, you know, I was still in, you know, a chunky dude or whatever. But I remember girls, you know, calling me ugly because I wasn't, you know, the typical you know, I guess pretty boy or whatever, just a regular average dude, you know, and I was in the fifth grade, so I was about 10 years old, you know, and um, that just stuck with me, you know, up until about maybe five or six years ago, you know, I saw a picture of myself that my boy put up, that was about 20 in the picture, and I was like, you know what, I'm, I wasn't a bad looking dude. You know, and um, wasn't bad looking dude at all. Then I thought about it. I said, well, if I saw a picture of myself that was taken today at the very moment that I looked at the previous picture, then what would I think about myself? So I can't be a bad looking dude now, right? Like, so I started to hook myself up, man. I started to, you know, love myself bless myself and, you know, stuff. Oh, that's my boy coming back. I'm definitely getting it. I was like, work. You getting the job? I, I can feel it. You can feel it? Yes. You can feel it in the air? I feel it. The dude was black. Okay. He was black? Number one. Okay. Okay. So you're going to hook a brother up? No, number two. Oh, what was talking about? What was it? Yeah, I Yo, used to work I'm, at Sears. I'm doing a video blog. I mean, I don't mind talking about it, but, you know. Oh. <laughs> Off yeah. Nah, that's cool. We can oh, talk yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, dude in there, he was like, he was like, you worked that serious? He was like, yeah, they closed down. I was like, he was like, what? I was just up there. I'm like, go look. The watch them. They closed They down. gone. Straight gone. All of them? No, 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 no. Not all of them. Just, just the one up the there. Just the watch them. And the right? Sears auto. Yeah. Yeah. He was like, oh. And I was yeah, like, yeah. Well, I don't want to talk about Sears economy right now, but yeah. yeah. So I had, I was able to loosen up just a little bit. You see the black, bald black dude over there and behind the desk? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. He gonna hook you up? I feel like he is. We gonna see. We gonna pray about it. Call you in a week or two. Or All right, cool. Gotcha. Keep my start. phone on, on sound. <laughs> All right, you better do your thing. I told my boy, I said, listen, you wanna, cause you, I want him to start his own business. But you need money for the startup. And I told him, I said, listen, since you at home, you ain't got no expenses, you know, you go get a job and stack your cash and get started. So anyway, I was talking before about, you know, low self-esteem and stuff. And I was like, you know, thinking about what they told me in the fifth grade. And I'm like, man, that stuff stuck with me for 30-something years. You know, almost 40 years. And I made my decisions, you know, based on me believe in somebody else what somebody else said about me so if if I look inside the word of God then what kind of decisions would I make if I believe what the word of God says about me like where would my limits be if I believe what the word says about me just believe that well that would be absolutely limitless you know, in the last video we talked about, you know, um, what did we talk about in the last video? I forgot. Well, we talked about something in the last video, but regardless of the fact, you know, if I believe what the word of God says about me, I can just, I should be able to succeed, right? You know, theoretically. And I'm doing a lot better because I believe what the word of God said about me. So... The point of the fact of the matter is, is that, you know,
people, you may say things to people and not really remember what you said to them. But that same word can stick to them for like decades, you know, and we just have to believe what the truth is, what the truth says about us, what the word says about us. And then we live our life according to that and not live our life according to, you know, what elementary school kids say about you. On that note, peace out.